Todd's Carpet and Tile Cleaning. Call or text 702-595-0488. If any of your bathrooms are feeling outdated, worn down, or simply too cluttered, it might be time to consider a remodel. Bailey Carson, head of everyday services at Angie and a home care expert, is here to offer tips on how to plan for the project and what to expect along the way. Bathrooms are some of the most underappreciated spaces in our homes. We spend time in them every day, and they should feel fresh and luxurious. No matter how large a renovation you're considering, The first thing to do is plan. The more time you spend up front thinking about what you want and need, the smoother the construction process will go. When remodeling a bathroom, the planning stage is often the longest part of the process. Start by thinking about your ideal finished bathroom and what might go into getting you there. Will this be a cosmetic refresh with a new coat of paint and some new hardware? Or do you want to redesign the whole space and put in a new shower, bathtub, or vanity? The scale of your remodel will help you determine whether you can DIY or it's best to bring in a pro. We always recommend a pro for electric and plumbing work, given these can be dangerous. However, you may also want to consider a general contractor. This person can help you put all the pieces together, make sure everything's coordinated, and ultimately help you end up with the bathroom that you've been dreaming of. To find the right contractor, ask for a few estimates from local pros. Check out online ratings and reviews, and don't be shy about asking for references and images of recent work. Once you've signed the contract, make sure to get any necessary permits. Get the paperwork out of the way, and then the fun part starts, finding the materials for your new bathroom. Everyone has different tastes, so have fun with things like paint colors, wallpaper, or tile patterns. But don't forget to think about resale value. Bathrooms are one of the most important rooms buyers look at, so it can pay off to design the room to be fresh, modern, and functional. When your design choices are made and materials on their way, it's time to get started on construction, which can range from a weekend to a few months depending on the complexity of the project. If you're working on your only bathroom, make sure you have a backup plan while it's out of commission, and then start by cleaning out the bathroom of any personal items or toiletries. Once your remodel is underway, try to be patient. There are a lot of folks doing remodels right now, so you may experience delays in getting things like city inspections and permits, as well as longer than usual delivery times on items like vanities, toilets, tubs, and other major items that are likely coming from overseas. Also, a great contractor is gonna help you manage this whole process and set your expectations and ultimately deliver on a timeline that's realistic. If you're doing a full bathroom remodel, make sure you do your research to understand the order of operations and build in extra time for any parts you're planning to DIY. Talk with your contractor about how long things usually take, then consider adding a few days. It'll de-stress the process a little and can help you avoid rescheduling fees. Remodeling your bathroom can be a fun weekend project or a major under taking. So take it step by step. Start by doing your research, including on pros, materials, and styles. Be sure you're reading all the contracts, asking good questions, and most importantly, set it up so that you enjoy the process. Do you have questions about your home projects or home care business? Tweet your question using hashtag AskingAngie. That's hashtag A-S-K-I-N-G-A-N-G-I, and you may get some tips in an upcoming segment.